Sorry, I cannot answer your question. Let's take a break. The break is over. Eyes on the screen. There's something weird looking about the dandelions in the garden. Hmm, I bet Kaya had something to do with this. You can only trust half of what he says, at best. To hide ugly realities behind a layer of charm and elegance. He's a mysterious character. He comes and goes like the wind, and is always occupied with important business. Whenever he talks to me, the outcome is usually one of two things. Morbid embarrassment, or unbearable awkwardness. How is it that even a captain is a disgusting booze hound? If there's anything bothering you, you know you can talk to me. Do you or do you not feel bonita? I feel bonita. <laughs> Wonderful, because you look bonita. He is Isaji's Kaya brother. They got separated when they are kids because his dad needed to work in another country together with his brother. So Isaji Kaya was adopted by another family that's why he is alone. Now that he was older they reunited as one. That is what the viewers wants. No more questions. Now react. He was cute as a young lad, but nowadays he just seems to be an old You know, when I was a kid, I used to think you were cool.
I got cheated out of my childhood. Why is this happening to me? I don't understand it. Was it maybe something I did or said? I always tried to keep something like this from happening to me. What was it that went so terribly wrong? I always tried not to say anything weird that would arouse the slightest suspicion. Could it possibly be true? Am I not supposed to have a body? Is that why all this is happening? <gasps> I should be dead. I really no. should be. I mean, she could do things and she could draw and, and she could make things. And I just do nothing. I can't no, do can. anything. Yes, no, I can't. Yes, can. No, I can't. I'm I can't help but repeat myself, I know it's not your fault Still lately I begin to shake for no reason at all For no reason at all And then he put his hand on my shoulder for a second. He didn't even squeeze it, he just, like, rested his hand on top of my shoulder. And I was just thinking, how could he not hate me? How could this guy not hate me? How could he not? How could he not hate me? What do you say? Couldn't possibly be my brother. I mean, just look at you. I thought we're not even related by blood! Not with how ugly you are! And now you're useless! Your one saving grace is your strength! And that's all you ever had! You're completely useless if you end up losing! So you're just a worthless, ugly freak now! <sighs> Don't give me that trap! If you were on your own, you'd be dead now! How many times have I saved you? You're the worthless one and you know it. You're too weak to stand on your own two feet. I can't believe I wasted my entire life protecting someone as useless as you. Don't talk to me about Sarah Lynn. No, I want to know how you're the victim of the Sarah Lynn story. I'm serious. Explain to me how Sarah Lynn's overdose was really rough for you. You feel a lot of guilt about that? You feel a lot of guilt because you were the only father figure she ever had? And then, when she was sober, you took her on a month-long bender, and then she died! And she is dead now! You are still alive! Your time is up. Then my last words. I love you, Catherine. You're determined to die with a lie on your lips! I love you, Catherine.